Why saturated fat and cholesterol should be limited? Diets high in saturated fat and cholesterol can contribute to high total cholesterol and a high low density lipoprotein LDL, the bad cholesterol level in the body, increasing your risk for coronary artery disease caused by atherosclerosis, which is plaque buildup in the arteries. Here's a list of foods that are high in cholesterol or saturated fat that you need to limit or avoid, 1. Eggs and meat. Limit whole eggs, since the yolk is what contains the cholesterol and saturated fats. Use egg whites or egg substitute for recipes calling for more than one whole egg. Note that you don't have to eliminate eggs entirely, particularly egg whites, which are high in protein. Limit high-fat cuts of beef like top loin, T-bone, tenderloin, porterhouse, brisket, rib eye, and flank steak. Choose meats labeled choice, select, and lean. Avoid so-called organ meats such as liver and sweetbreads, which have as much as 375 mg of cholesterol per 3 ounce serving. Limit processed and luncheon meats such as bologna, ham, hot dogs, sausage, and packaged lunch meats. They're high in saturated fats and sodium. Avoid duck and goose, though note that lean, skinless breast or leg are lower fat choices. Avoid frying anything in duck or goose fat. 2. Dairy. Limit your intake of whole fat dairy products such as butter and whole milk, as well as 2% fat dairy products, such as yogurt and cheeses. If you are used to drinking whole milk or using full fat dairy products, try switching to low fat or 1% milk and dairy products. Once you feel comfortable with low fat or 1%, try skim milk and non-fat dairy products. 3. Oils. Cut back on foods containing partially hydrogenated vegetable oils to reduce trans fat in your diet. Check the food labels of packaged foods for the terms hydrogenated or partially hydrogenated oil. If these terms appear as one of the first five ingredients, it would be advisable to avoid or limit those products. 4. Slides. Limit French fries and other fried dishes made with partially hydrogenated or saturated fats. Try baked sweet potato fries or fruit for a healthier alternative. 5. Desserts. Limit cakes, cookies, crackers, pastries, pies, muffins, and donuts, especially those made with partially hydrogenated or saturated fats. When baking at home, consider low-fat recipes to make your desserts more cholesterol-friendly. If you're just starting a low-cholesterol diet, it's helpful to refer to a list of high-cholesterol and high-saturated fat foods to avoid and limit. Remember, it's never too late to adopt healthier eating habits. To discover how to lower your cholesterol levels, click on the link in description. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, comment and share if this video is useful for you.